Player 2, press start! Hi everyone and welcome back to Player 2 Press Start, and guess what? We're playing Mother 3 and we're in this devastating attic of an attic of an attic. It's an attic of an attic, I'll tell you that much. And it's uh, gonna be a rough time, oh, but uh, we're yeah. gonna show it to you guys. This is gonna be, this is probably a lot of players, you know, most difficult area, honestly. Oh, big time. Um, we're definitely not prepared for it. So the reason I, I, withdraw all, I withdrew all my money before was so that I can buy some things. Unfortunately, it looks like the things I want to buy are things I just cannot afford. So that sucks. Plain and simple. Yeah. Especially needed that better stick. Uh, we're going to try it. Let's see what we can sell here. Better stick's a big um, one. Who has my saltwater guns? Uh, I don't know. I thought I ha he has a saltwater. He someone has it. Okay. Yay. There we go. That's good. Those are completely useless in the attic, so we can get rid of those right now. Uh, they sell for a pretty penny. Oh god, better stick, yes. Definitely gonna use that. Uh, easy grip stick, yes. We're we gonna go buy easy grip stick. Um, squeak, thanks. Alright, now we are prepared. Not really. Um, <laughs> Not at all. Yeah, but we're gonna go through the attic anyway and see what's going on. Pick up the attic guide. Hey, look, it's item guy. Item guy's here. We're gonna give him some stuff because we can. And it's just things that we don't really need right now. Like the DC MC pamphlet. Look, I did it again. And maybe the major look, because, like, when is that ever? Yeah, we're not really gonna need it. Um, it's got a bunch of these hot spring eggs, so that's oh, nice. Oh, yeah, that's, that's gonna be we nice. We got some bombs. Um, eye drops. When the tears just won't stop. See, I'm gonna need that when I'm done with this place. Because <laughs> I'm gonna put the tears. They're not gonna stop. You're good, you're gonna cry. I'm yes. Gonna cry all night. I'm gonna cry. Actually, should I? Uh, I'll just hold on to him for now. Not a big deal. No Moving on! Oh god. Nope. Oh yeah, they, they, they start hard with nope. fast. Nope. Uh. <laughs> nope. 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 <sighs> you gotta try it. Oh, you could've ran. Could've tried to run nah, through. I wanna fight him. I gotta fight him. An arachnid! Oh! <laughs> and it's it her. Oh, <laughs> Blocked away. That is their way. That's how you say their name. Yeah. Four exclamation points, man. You gotta, you gotta do them right. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're just gonna bash... I guess. I mean, they have low defense, they only have about 180 HP, but they will poison you. That's the bad thing. Don't you bite me! At least they got some tunes when they bite you, you know? I don't know the beat to this song. Like, obnoxiously slow? Jeez. It's gotta be like... Seven beats per minute. I don't, I don't know, I can't figure it out. I, Duster! Duster? Where are you? Why aren't you here? I need your pendulum. We need to hit. Oh, <laughs> he made his pendulum. Uh. Oh, damn it, course. Pony! Right off the bat. I don't know. It must be like obnoxiously slow. Does Jenkins even know healing? Oh wow, it is yet? super. Annoying. Yeah, yeah, he does. So I can use that. Bony is level 12. That's good. We're gonna need more levels if we are to make it out of here alive. Yeah, you want to be, um, you know, in the. Mid twenties probably for this area. Oh boy, <laughs> something like that. Um, but you do want to conserve your PP, so getting poisoned is not good. How much PP do I have? I have forty-seven. Let's do that, I guess, for now. Uh, is that a mouse? It's something. Something that wants to bite you. Let's see here. He's pretty greedy. I don't know what he is. Okay, I think where I want to go right now is this way. I know this isn't the right way, but. No, because I think the blue uh, paths are the correct one. Yes, that is correct. Man, oh man, now that is a slew of enemies. Uh, hot spring is below, so yeah. I'll do that. We're basically, you know, we're running into everybody so we can do a little bit of uh, leveling up. So we're not trying to conserve everything too much quite yet. Dude, like... And there are some things coming up that'll kind of rejuvenate you a little bit. A tiny, tiny bit. But these uh, greedy mice can drop a good amount of items, actually. 30% chance for a bag of Big City Fries, 50% chance for peculiar cheese, and 10% for a Big City Burger. Let's see what happens. We weren't having- oh. <laughs> what? I oh, didn't get any items. Oh. Uh, we weren't really having too much luck. I did get- I, did, I got a magic tart, though. Hey. Yay! Yeah, that made what it was. And that was a little- Alright, I need to get past this. what's to come ahead in that room. I do- oh. I do like the enemies up here. It's pretty cool. They- they fit the situation very well. I'm just going all out. I don't care. I don't- I just don't want him to kill Boney. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. 
out. Yeah, that's right. I'm going all out. You definitely did. Pulling out the stops. The stops were pulled? Ooh, an antidote. Why didn't Boney just use an egg or something? All right, here we go. Because I don't want to waste items. Okay. All right. Especially when I'm this close to a hot spring, bruh. Okay. Why would I want to waste my time doing I that? I don't know. Actually, well, it'd be saving time. But that's aside the point. Okay. The point is there's a hot spring and I'm going to use it. I mean, that's why it's Where there. Where is Violet? I need her it's fucking... right there for that. Oh, you're Violet. Where, where is Kumatora? I need... Actually... Some PSI that is elemental. That would be kind of funny, though, to name her Violet. <laughs> why? Why is, that, why is that funny? I miss it. Uh, because, you know, it's like at this point in the game, she's going to be like, it's, it's me, Violet! <laughs> you know? Get it? Nope. What? How can you not get it? I don't get it. If you name Kumatora Violet... Oh, I got it. I got it now. And another familiar enemy, Elder Batty. Oh my god. They can drop bug spray 15% of the time, but it's super helpful up here because then that'll one shot the arachnids. So if you want to give a uh, bony, you know, bug spray and stuff, you can kill these poisonous insects right away. These are pretty quick, and that way you can avoid getting poisoned and stuff, which also saves full time. combo. Ultra combo! Don't you do it? Oh! I wonder if that's a 100% chance to get poisoned when I use that attack. Or if it's like a 30% chance. I'm sure it's not 100, but it definitely not. Right? right? Leave it in the comments, guys, if you know! Oh, oh, oh! This, this, this song's a little bit easier to combo to, I feel like. Well, good for you! Oh, good for me! Hey, shut up. What? What do you mean? Alright, um... Let's heal myself, and then I'm gonna life up my bones here. Oh, bones have been fluffed. Yeah, I said it. You did. What are you gonna uh, do about uh, it? How, oh. do I get to, how do I get down there? I have to go... That that one? Yeah, that was from the room oh, before. Oh, shit. Are you gonna do it, though? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Shoot. I mean, it's sort of worth it. I yes, agree. Not really. I don't, whatever it is. Move! I can mouse. tell you what it is. I do have the handy player's guide with me, but you okay. got there. And there you go. Yeah, some some PP with an antidote. You know. Players. There, now we're back you to where we were. Poison. Okay, fine. I did it. I'm you pro. You didn't get poisoned. I get am pro. What's down here? A uh, very angry instrument. <laughs> uh, yes, that is correct. Uh, is there anything? I think there is an item over here. I'm just gonna skip him for now. Oh, it's down there. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So is this a waste? Looks like it. Uh, no. We'll see how big of a waste here in a second. You got a giant spider block in your way. I hate this beat. It's like so ridiculously slow. Oh, it's meant to mess with your brain. I, I didn't even get it. I don't, I don't even know. I don't. I can't. I just can't. I can't be. I can't it's combo those. It's just too slow. Oh, well, I got those antidotes. There goes the one antidote. It's all right. We got the EXPs and the money and the cash. No, if you had stocked up on antidotes in the first chapter, this would not be a problem. <laughs> <Shut> but no. <laughs> that would be really cool though. If there was some kind of item management where you could deposit the antidotes at the beginning of the game and withdraw them now. Well, actually, I'm okay with using PP for oh, now. Really? Yeah. I'm, what's in here? No That's... problems. No problems in that pipe. <laughs> this is a very cluttered and giant attic. When I, when you yeah, I know, right? There's like two giant keyboards there. There's a bunch of buckets of shovels for some reason. <laughs> well, there... There's a jacket over there. Yeah, they look more like uh, mops and buckets. Yeah, okay. But still, there's a lot. Oh, no! What? Bony! Let's fight this greedier mouse. Let's take everything he has. Maybe we'll get a big city burger. Some delicious healing items. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, Boney. You do your job as a dog. You bite that freaking mouse in the face. <laughs> Lucas. God damn it, Jenkins! <laughs> Jenkins! You're terrible! All I didn't right. mean it. I didn't mean it. Okay. Now Come let's on, just Adam. pop his head off and use his body. It's <laughs> a weapon! <laughs> you know, mouse body. Yeah. Good weapon. Maybe you can do that with one of the, the instruments um, up here. The instruments. Where am I? Okay, so... I do want to go down because... You want to grab that item. Yes. And bag of big shitty fries! Big shitty flies! Oh, uh, get it! Uh, oh, okay. Oh, damn it. Oh, yes, right. yes, I did it. Oh, wait, no, what? I didn't. What? He wasn't even by you. We're gonna do it 
because I don't like these guys, and I have a reason for wanting to do it as well. So a gently weeping guitar and a beaten drum. They can both drop some really good items, but they're very low percentages. Oh. That guitar has got a 5% chance for magic gelatin, and that drum has a 3% chance for- Oh my god, it just changed the beat! Oh yeah, they're- they're bastards. I don't- I don't know the beats of this. Jesus. Oh god, oh. Bony! Oh. No, Bony! Bony! No! <laughs> You're a terrible owner of Oh pets. man, this is bad. Uh, yeah, the drum and the guitar, they got a good amount of help. Alright, well, the drums got over three all's well that ends well. And this isn't one of those times. <laughs> this is not one of those times at all. <laughs> um, okay, so... It's kind of giving uh, a little preview into what's to come, I guess. Yeah, I mean, as we said before, we are low level, so... Uh, is this it, though? I think I just made it. Made it. <sighs> Shit, no. Not quite. You're gonna want to go back anyways. Just, you know, revitalize a falling comrade. Oh, jeez. I, I, may, I may have to be forced to uh, revitalize. Maybe forced to I, I may not be able to make it to where I want to go. Couldn't run. Alright, well, this is bad. Uh oh. This is uh -oh. bad for me. Not good. Not good. I just want to make it. No, I don't think that's going to happen. No! Oh. Oh. At least you didn't have that much money on you, right? No, I spent it all. Well, that's a plus. Make him dead. Okay, now I got Speaking the thing. Speaking of jellies. Oh my god. So you don't room. Send them healing items. Get rid of these uh, bread rolls. Should I get... Well, these are alright. Or get rid of the right? cookie. You don't need the cookie. There you go. Cookie's gone. Magic gelatin, which is great. Is oh, oh! We're learning! We're learning the ways. Okay, I should probably... Feverish. I should probably, uh... You know, work this off before I go into the room full of baddies and spiders and shit. Yes. Because I want to run. The suspense. I just want to make it. I just want to make it to that room. You know. And the room straight south from here is death. So we're yeah. going to be avoiding that one. Yeah, we, we're not going there yet. We we know better because we know better. I think oh, there it is. What are you doing? Off that side. Off it. Off it. <laughs> we pressed, left off <laughs> I pressed it too quick. That was offense up. Alpha, Alpha, which will be useful. You guys have seen Yes, we made it. There. Now, the reason why I did not want to... I mean, I used all my PK powers because each wanna... of these three boxes, and yes, I do want to okay. open at least one. Actually, well, just one. That's all you really need. So do use these sparingly. Some nice rice stuff is inside. You eat it right there. And? You're fully revitalized! revitalized. And uh, you get fully healed from them. Which is great, even if even if you have dead party members, they come back to life because of the rice. Oh, so now let's save the game. Yay! Okay, finally. Now the rice stuff, basically what those three do, they all, uh... There's three presents in the room. Uh, nice stuff, rice stuff, and nice rice stuff. And even though they all give you different messages, the effects of each box are pretty much the same. Nope. They revive fallen party members, restores 50 HP to all members, and restores 50 PP to Lucas. So, very useful items. Very, very useful. Right, doesn't restore them full? No. It only, only gives you a certain amount. Oh, well, I guess it's fine. But it's definitely good enough for where you're at. These mice are hilarious, by the way. Oh, I love them. Eh? Is that you, Alfie? What you been with for seeing you, dicky bird? You didn't come by on New Year's on crack a night? See, your grandma and I have been all jack. So, watch out, you? You must have been playing the market, even, eh? Is some of that nut bread for you? Wait, so wait. <laughs> <laughs> Jazz pads are full. Come back. <laughs> it's so good. Come back, baked potato potato. Yeah, so he wanted to give us some nut bread, but we're full, so that's what he says. Yeah. This guy, I don't think he's as obnoxious, is he? Oh, definitely is. Oi, Alfie, it's been donkeys, Chaya. Want to rabbit is. Uh, I can't even do it. Want to rabbit is out in some mobiles? Is that it? That's Calvin! They all bought all using the bugs. But mom's the dicky. <laughs> That's so good. Oh, you're your bad. <laughs> you're just bad. Oh, day, what, you, what did you try to give me? I don't know. I'm trying to give you something nice. Don't want it. Let me see here. It's a uh, peculiar cheese, I believe, is what he's trying to give you. Oh, uh, well, fuck the eye drops then. Fuck them drops, yo! Fuck the drops, let's get the cheese. These mice are definitely some of my favorite in the game. Oh, yeah. 
Let's kill your cheese. We've been waiting a bloody old long while. I'm there back with you. It's taking your own trouble. <laughs> I think you said Toblerone. Uh, I, I was a little too quick. I couldn't quite do it. I know. My bad. All right, I'm save again. The save is save. Now, the question is, Jenkins, are we going to attempt? Are we going to attempt? We have to attempt. You can attempt once. Saved. Might as well, right? Right? Yeah, I can, I can attempt. You gotta attempt. Can attempt. It's, oh. it's probably gonna be a whole bunch of failure, but we're going to attempt. Alright. Would you say this is the hardest- one of the hardest in the game? I think so. I think it is. Like, top three, at least. I think it's just because it's like a... It's a nice little difficulty curve they threw in there. Yeah, it's definitely a lot harder than anything up to this point. Yeah, big time. Thanks. I mean, a lot of the bosses also kind of, you know, they they just do funny stuff. Like the snake, he does a big attack, yeah, but then he goes underneath the water, blows some bubbles. The tank, you just have to get halfway through and then it blows up, so then the cannon's not going to kill you. So they've definitely been pretty easy up to this point. Or at least they, they have something about them that makes them a little bit easier. Should I keep the flea powder? I don't even know what it does. It's man. just, it's good for bony. What's it do? Uh, best solution for flea problems are gone before you know it. I don't... Does he get fleas? Is I it guess. Like a thing that happens? Yeah. I don't know what it does. Uh, uh, goodbye. Hi, oh, guys. I probably am going to regret that. Get rid of the flea powder? Yeah. Alright, here we go. Let's, uh, let's psych up. I mean, you can get fleas, so it just cures that status. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. I have a plan, my see. I am a wooden base. I'm still in my prime. But since that base below showed up, I've been left to rot in this moldy smelling attic. <sighs> I'm filled with so much frustration. I'm gonna turn this frustration into violence and take my stress out on you guys. You're gonna be bawling your eyes out. Guys, come on, let's get him! Oh, you freaking jerk! And that's one of the reasons why this is such an insanely hard fight. Oh. Because it starts with these three and it gets even worse. But this is the chapter boss of Chapter 4, the Jealous Base. While it has powerful attacks on its own, it can team up with its cohorts to make groovy group attacks that put the hurt on you. Stop the music by blasting in with your PK special and a bomb. Just gonna have to do it. Oh yeah, I mean, if, these things will just destroy you with this jam session. Oh man. Now there's a little bit of luck to it, oh, just man. based on who they hit. Oh man. But this looks oh, man. decent. They didn't destroy Boney. Yeah, they didn't kill Boney one thing. hit. And the back guitar is dead. The drums are still alive. The drums are close to death. Oh god. Well, let's see, if you did... I don't know if you heal both. I'm gonna have Boney try and use the, the item. The hot spring egg. Oh, there you go. Nom nom nom! Okay, oh, forgot about the jam session, still happens. Yep. Okay, hit Boney. Hit Boney again! Okay, that's okay. Alright, at least the drum's gone. The drum's gone. Now, the base has about a thousand health. Wow. So I think you got, what, 300 on him right now? Uh, something like that, yeah. A little bit more, I'm sure. Is this a double heal? Double helix? No, it's not. Oh. It's just a singular. Singular heal. Yeah, goes to a fit of rage. And now that happened. This offense just went up by 23. Yeah, this is where things can get a little bit hairy. Yeah, this guy had 58 offense to begin with, so it's it's up. <laughs> Should I buff Boney with offense up? Uh, I don't know. No. Mm, let's just stick with the... With the Lovin? We're just gonna stick to PK Lovin him? Lovin and bombs, I guess. Yeah, because there's bombs at him. That's a thing. Come on. Ugh, that wasn't very good. Yeah, he's got some highlight kits, unfortunately. No, it was a sprinting bomb. Oh, well, he also has high bomb. <laughs> I mean, it's not high, but it's not, it's not good for you, necessarily. But, I mean, bombs help. They're better than what Boney would normally do. You know, these, these hot spring eggs really help. Oh, yeah. That, that was definitely a good move. But this is why I highly recommend getting console rockets, because Boney can use those, and they hit, like, 300 or something like yeah, that. Yeah, well, we couldn't afford them, all right? No. But if that's your opener, it is a PK love, and a... Especially if you use a pencil rock with Boney, he can usually do that first, and you can probably avoid a jam session. Which is real nice. Because everyone dies, and then the first turn of the Jealous Base is just to use his offense up. That's true. Yes. But the solo jam sessions with his high offense is very gnarly. 80, not bad. Alright. Um, um, yep, yep, um, yep, yep. Um, um, it's all downhill now. <laughs> yeah, this is where things really but start you got, to... You got stuff to get your, your PP back. Oh, yeah, I should do that. Oh, why the hell not? 
This is just 20, go. these are 30. So let's go ahead and use a 30. Pony is gonna use the egg. Some spring eggs. Man, I actually know with these hot spring eggs, that's gonna that's so helpful. I, I should have gotten more, honestly. Yeah. Such an intense noise. Sound. Not a noise, it's a sound. It's pleasant. Does he have anything other than those? He has some cheese. Would you like some cheese? Or I, don't think, Bo I don't think Bonnie really likes cheese. I think Jenkins likes cheese, though. I know I like cheese. <laughs> so. <laughs> that is you. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, <laughs> Jenkins loves cheese. Dude, it's so true. All right, that, that was painful. But we got more eggs here. Oh, what? Oh, oh my stop. god! Low level! Oh my god! That was good. I was, I was not, not expecting that at all. Not expecting to win there. We had it all planned out like I was gonna have to grind and. I expect you to die at the first jam session. I'm I'm surprised. Yeah. Or I was expecting him to hit you a little bit harder too. And we don't. You don't even have the. It's, oh wow. You, just, you don't even have like the the fan merch. No, I don't, stuff I don't have harder. the best equipment not at, all. at all. So we're just getting really lucky. There's a hole here. Are we trying to jump down? Hell no! I'm sorry, guys, but we're out of time. Oh, you don't get it. Uh, so we're gonna jump down here next episode. But thank you so much for watching up to now. What an episode! Wow, can't believe. Wow, we, we, wow. Can't believe that. Make sure to comment and subscribe and hit that like button down below. It helps us out so much. It makes us feel great, and we always really, really appreciate it. Indeed. So, till next time. Take it easy, guys. Hi, everybody, and welcome back to the End Slate. So, did anybody see the news story on GameSpot about the Final Fantasy Mystic Quest remake? You didn't? How? Why not? It was the best Final Fan. Okay, I can't even finish that sentence. But really, though, um, some group, some team known as Dark Design or something along those lines have come out and said, Hey, look, we're making a Final Fantasy Mystic Quest remake, and this is officially endorsed by Square Enix. Now, at first, when I was watching it, I was like, well, you know, Square Enix makes some really weird decisions now, but, um, <clears throat> You know, I could see this being a thing, and it looks to be on par with their other old school Final Fantasy remakes. Yes, it was, it played the part. It played the part well. <clears throat> but then I saw and heard some RPG Maker sounds and graphics. Um, or reverse those, whatever. Either way, I, I noticed some RPG Maker assets. RPG Maker VX, I believe, for the PC. And uh, great program, by the way, if you've never used it. And uh, it's really easy and fun. Um, so at that point, I realized, well, wait a minute. This is a fan game, and it's probably not endorsed by Square Enix. And this is probably a really big scam. Um, and there's a number of, of things that would you know, make this apparent, but, but my point is, is that has anybody played this, the uh, the Final Fantasy remake Square has been putting out, like, uh, for mobile, um, like, uh, the Final Fantasy 5 or 6? My point is, is that they look very RPG Maker-esque, and they're losing their identity for these games by employing these developers that are just downright lazy when it comes to, uh, you know, graphics. They're just not skilled in that area to where they make these games and they make them look like RPG Maker games. That's why I'm able to look at this stupid fan-made Final Fantasy Mystic Quest remake and say, yeah, yeah, this looks like Square Enix's quality nowadays for these remakes. I could totally see this being a thing. And uh, GameSpot apparently did too, but it's it's not the case. And then, you know, whoever these dark design people are, they, they knew, you know, they, they probably knew that people would think this is legit because this is what Square Enix's remakes look like now. And I'm a huge opponent of what they did to Final Fantasy VI uh, for the remake for mobile because that game deserves so much more. It deserved the Final Fantasy IV remake treatment and it got nothing close to that. It, it just, it's... Oh, why did they do it? It's my favorite Final Fantasy. Oh, man. But that's my rant for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and we'll see you tomorrow.